Hi guys, today on Divas Can Cook, we are making one of my favorite recipes for oven baked barbecue beef ribs. The meat is just amazing. Oh my gosh, wait till you guys taste it. And it is easy to make, so let's go. Okay, I'm starting with about uh, a little under three pounds of beef ribs. They've been washed and dried. Now I'm just going to douse them with a little bit of liquid smoke. Now if you are not into liquid smoke, honey, then you can totally skip this step. But I like that smoky taste to it. So I add a little bit of liquid smoke. Then I'm gonna add on some extra virgin olive oil. Go ahead and take your little hands and massage the ribs. Okay, they love to be touched. Touch the meat. Massage the ribs. Okay. All right, now that our meat is all felt up, we're just gonna add a ton of spices. It's gonna add lots of flavor to the meat, and it's also gonna help tenderize a little bit. Make sure you mix it really good, break up that brown sugar in there. And now we're just gonna throw on the shimmer, add all of that seasoned mixture. You don't have to use all of it, but I like mine really, really seasoned, so I use a crap load of that seasoning. Now you're gonna add a little bit more olive oil if you need to to kind of help distribute the seasoning. We don't want a whole bunch of dry seasoning sitting on top of this meat. So go ahead and add more olive oil, give it a nice little massage, work in all of those seasonings so they become one with the meat. Next we're gonna cover it up. We're gonna refrigerate this for about one to two hours. I just said one hour. Then after one hour, go ahead and just place this on a foil lined baking sheet. Make sure you put it in a single layer, okay? Just like this, make sure they have plenty of room. We're gonna make a little pouch for these bad boys to cook in. So go ahead and fold your foil up on the side. Make sure it's nice and tucked in. Then we're gonna add another layer of foil um, on top of it and create like a nice little cute little packet for them to cook in. You don't want any steam escaping, so make sure you do it like really nice and tight because we want to keep it nice and sealed, okay? All right, then we're gonna bake this at 250, super low for about three and a half hours. You can go four hours if you need to, all right? When it comes out, drain off that fat and it'll look just like this, kinda ugly, but that's all right because we're gonna add on our favorite barbecue sauce, just a little bit, you don't need much. I don't like my ribs real saucy. Go ahead and brush the ribs with the barbecue sauce. I'm using Sweet Baby Ray's because it's so good. And look how tender this meat is, you guys. This butter knife just cut through it so effortlessly. It's so good, it's so the bomb, okay? You can go ahead and broil it on low until the sauce is nice and sticky if you want to. And then when you're ready to serve it, go ahead and hit it with a little bit of parsley. Parsley makes everything look so gourmetish, doesn't it? I love parsley. And now dig in, look at this meat, y'all. This is what I'm talking about. This is a oven baked barbecue rib. My husband said, Monique, do not make any other recipe because these ribs took me somewhere on the journey. So yeah, they're the bomb. Don't forget you can find this recipe on my blog at divasandcook.com. Thank you guys so much for watching. Later.